Alright, I saw that you needed help um, with the setup for your um, camcorder video game capture. Um, I've done it. It really does work. Um, and I was going to record it, how to do it, but I just ended up being confused. And so I think I, it's better off if I just drew out <laughs> instructions for you. So here we go. Here, I don't know what system you use or whatever, but let's say you're using a PlayStation and I'm going to stand it vertically. There's your PlayStation. Blah, 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 blah. And then your TV has its inputs. With the only one that matters is yellow and red, the inputs. Okay, so what you're going to want to do is then your cables to your PlayStation come running out. Then you have your red which is your audio and yellow which is oops yellow which is your video input like so and you have that coupler and everything that's good and also you have the component cables for the TV so here we go you have your cables for the TV this is the yellow one this is the right one and also you have your couplers which is very good as well so here I saw that you had the three-sided one so the three-sided coupler that had your red white and yellow but again all you really need is red and yellow so that's the coupler with the red that's the coupler with the yellow and you connect your PlayStation cables to the corresponding cables which is that into the coupler so that's your PlayStation cable red going into the red coupler PlayStation cable yellow going into the yellow coupler but what we're gonna need here from this output which is something that I didn't see in your video here's the red output for the coupler here's the yellow output for the coupler you're gonna need a splitter it's a device called a splitter um, which what it does is it makes two outputs now God, let me turn back to black two outputs there's one output for red one out two outputs for red and two outputs for yellow you go to any electronics store and they'll have splitters they're cheap I got mine for five bucks now what you want to do is um, what this does is allow you to hook up your red for your TV which is right here the component cables for your TV hook that up BAM and then your yellow for your TV hook that up and now these other two what they go to are the AV cables for your camera which is all you need so this is your camera it has the AV cables going around it is splits to red it is splits to yellow so now you have the complete hookup the complete setup from your PlayStation going into the coupler red and coupler yellow your TV cable is going into the coupler red and coupler yellow and the splitter which is right here going in from the TV allows you to go into the TV as well as the camera and the video to yellow as well as the camera and that's about it that's all you need that's the complete hookup also what you might need though is um once you have that set up you're gonna wanna set it into VCR mode VCR and that's how you're gonna record your gameplay what it's on um if like if it was like mine how it happened was it didn't want to record it at first so I went into my camera and I messed with the VCR settings in the menu there and what I did, it had a mode called Audio Visual Output Mode. Out. And you're going to want to turn that on. So turn that on, and then it'll allow you to record everything. And all you need is some sort of connection from your camera to your PC. Um, be it by FireWire or USB cable. And that is what your PC will be your PC will automatically turn on um, 
uh, Windows Movie Maker or whatever media player you have as default, and then that's where you'll capture it from. So I hope that was informative. If not, just feel free to ask more questions.